Professional table tennis players are usually intrinsic motivated to perform hundreds of services in a row during service training. Sometimes they use training tools, like in this case a towel, for motivation or to provoke a better placement. But why not add emotions to our service training? During this competitive exercise, we have two players practicing services with forehand and backhand, and one player who is rolling the ball and performing sidesteps. The advantages of this exercise are first, organizational since three players work at one table and two players use the same ball box. Second, motivational, because two players are in a direct battle and count the scoring. Third, emotional, since both service players feel the pressure. Fourth, in perception, because the service players have to focus on the ball touch and peripheral on the moving ball that is a symbol for the moving opponent. Fifth, in conditioning and coordination, since the player who is rolling the ball performs sidesteps all the time and has to give the ball the appropriate boost. So let's have a look how this battle ends. During this exercise, the coach should give feedback to the following four aspects, because an exercise implies key features to achieve specific objectives. Aspect 1. A good throw of the ball during service. Aspect 2. A first bounce of the ball near the baseline during the topspin serve. Aspect 3. A good quality of side steps with a deep body position for player 3. And aspect 4, the right intensity and direction of the rolling ball that should always remain on the table. When you use this exercise the first time, the following challenges can occur for the player who is rolling the ball. First, roll the ball straight, otherwise it will fall down the baseline or roll towards the net. Second, the starting point of the side steps is too late or third, the rolling ball is too fast so that it falls down on the other side. Fourth, side steps are performed with a poor quality which means in a too upright body position and with the body weight on the whole foot instead of the forefoot. Nevertheless, this exercise can be a motivating challenge for three players at one table. The exercise can be applied with an alternating use of the high quality single player multi ball service training. Thanks for watching and have fun during training.